What's up, house fans? It's me, Packy, and today I'm doing part two of making an illegal bowling ball. I got this brand new Deviate Collision here. I'm gonna make it illegal. But how I'm gonna make it illegal, you guys will have to find out once I take it back to the drill room. So I will see you guys down at the Shocker Sports Grill and Lanes right about, hold on, hold on, but first, oh, <coughs> but first, you guys know what to do. Just hit that subscribe button down below, down below. Just hit that subscribe button down below to follow along for more videos like this and more PBA tournament vlogs. And we're out. All right, so I've drilled it with a normal dual angle layout, 60 degrees by four and three quarters by 65 degree layout. I'm now gonna take it down to the lanes, bowl one game with it, show you guys that normal reaction that it gives me, and then I'm going to take it back to the drill room, make this thing so illegal you guys won't even be able to believe it. And then I'm gonna take it back to the lanes and show you guys why it's illegal and why they changed the rule a little bit and what rule they changed. And now let's go to the lanes. So I'm, I'm obviously no professional when it comes to being in the pro shop. I basically know how to throw two finger holes in the ball and that's it. Same. Same with Sloan, even though he owns a pro shop. So uh, Sloan, yes, sir. now that we have you here, um, why are weight holes actually illegal? I know they changed the rule like two years ago. There's a variety of different reasons because obviously you can change the shape. My hair looks terrible. It's okay. Mine always looks terrible. Anyway. Uh, here, there we go. You can, change, you can change the shape and the ball reaction based off where you put the extra hold. So there's a couple of different positions that you can put weight holds, depending on size, depth, and that will manipulate the ball. I want to make this the most illegal. So I'm going to put a big, so you're saying big hole deep. I mean, deep, big hole, yeah, pretty much. You mark with a pencil where I should put the weight hole. Just throw it on there. That, that's not far away. It's pretty low, but we like it. That's not far away. It's a good guess. How much more is it going to hook now? Miles. Like three to seven. 
boards maximum. I wasn't sure what the measurement was going to be. I was going to say. Three yeah. to seven. Yeah, three to seven. Arrows. I don't know. So, yeah, just go with... So, obviously, the biggest bit that you can put in it... Um, inch and a quarter. Yeah. On tour, it was an inch and three-eighths. Everything else was an inch and a quarter previously, but okay. I believe on the PBA, you could use an inch and three-eighths. So, if, inch and three-eighths as deep as I can. Only on the PBA. And since you're a PBA player... Inch and three eighths. I'll, I'll allow it. All the way in. Yeah, inch and three eighths and just go like two and a half deep and... All right, so we went with an inch and a quarter because USB-C regulations, inch and a quarter. We'll stick to that. Um, inch and a quarter, two inches deep, three to seven boards more per Chris Sloan, and this is where it's going. I don't know where that is in relation to my pap. Frankie just put it on the ball and he's an expert ball driller. Yesterday, Sloan, you watched that performance. Okay, well, I shot 260 game one. If I, uh, if I shot 260 game one, what am I shooting? Game two, with hole, three to seven boards more, probably earlier. Definitely earlier. Definitely earlier, Patrick. 100%. What am I shooting, though? Um, I would say a good score would be about 167 after watching the ball yesterday. But 167, that's, that's on making all my spares. I would say, if I had to be an optimist, I would say about 226 out the gate. 226. If I shoot any less or more than 226, it's the last video on the channel, boys. What? Let's get to the lanes. lied to me. This ball hooks like three to four less and it hooks way earlier. It kind of bails out down lane. The ball's actually not bad. It was surprised it surprised me today. That was perfect. I've never thrown a better shot in my life. Not only do I need this next one, then I need to get one. It's a toughie. <clears throat> Time to break out Mackie, laser pointer, and her head.
I need one. Two twenty six. If I shoot any less or more than two twenty six, it's the last video on the channel, boys. Do I go for the seven or the ten? You gotta go for the seven. Ah. That was my moment for like a legendary moment on the channel. I got no clutch. All right, well guys, I, I, I did my best. 228, and this is the last video on the channel that you're gonna see, because Sloan challenged me and I just, I wasn't up for it. I got three instead of one. No clutch. Pressure makes diamonds, mate. I said pressure makes diamonds. <laughs> what did you say to me? All right, so as you guys saw, Christopher Sloan is an absolute liar, because he told me it was gonna hook three to seven more. It hooked the exact same amount, just in a way different way. So as you guys saw, with the weight hole, it was much slower. It didn't hook quite as much down lane, but it gave me a little miss from in, and honestly, it just made it, it made it smoother. So it made it almost like a hybrid turned into like a solid type shape down lane. Um, so I need to figure out how to drill balls like that because I loved it. Yeah, what I'm telling all you two-handers is, Christopher Sloan is a genius, and I'm gonna start laying balls out a little smoother because I really like the way that looked, but either way, DB8 collision, money, Packy spare game, garbage. Video out.